know, the handyman told me to use the pre-stain. So, what it does apparently is that it prevents blotchiness, controls grain raising, and thank, thank goodness it's uh, soap and water cleanup. Alright, I have my pre-stain and I stirred it thoroughly. And I have my synthetic brush. And let me get my rag. Okay, I got my rags. And quite interested. I hate how that I can't get that off of here, but it's gonna be on the inside of the pantry, so whatever. do is, is I have some little samples left over. This color is a uh, golden pecan. So let's try that one. so puppy dog doesn't get it. See how it has that orange color to it? I'm not fond of that at all. Let me go rinse out my brush and do another one. All right, this one's called Summer Oak. I think this is gonna be the one. Because I told him, I said, please do not put down that orange. I don't like orange oak looking floors. I think they're ugly. I don't know. Stir this up real good and see what we got. Alright. I kind of like that one. Alright. Let that soak a minute. And then we'll see. All right, let's see what that looks like. Now let's try this one. All right, this one basically doesn't have any color. It's just, yeah. Let 
All right, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to return. I'm going to go to the store and I'm going to return that one because that's the one I bought. That I don't like at all. This is the one I think I'm going to go with right here. And that one was the uh, Summer Oak. So I'm going to go with Summer Oak. I've stained it. I think it looks good. I think it looks the same to me. All right, I've got about an hour before work and I am not going to be using an oil-based stain. I am going to be using the poly shades. And since my floors are a little bit of a different shade, uh, the new wood versus the old wood, as you can see, that's the new wood and this is the old wood. This is a little bit more red and this is a little bit more golden. So I just decided to quit fussing. I was going to get the summer oak, but they don't sell it in the non-oil base. So there you have it. So I'm just going to go for it. I don't have time to nitpick. And I'm just going to just do it. Just do it. It's stain and polyurethane in one. Uh, I need to hurry up and get this done because I got company coming. And I have to get my house cleaned up. Look at all this. There's stuff everywhere. So let me go get my paintbrush. And we'll get this applied and get going. Now this you do not wipe like you would with an oil base stain. You have to, I have to do two thin coats and wait six hours in between coats and I have to sand in between coats with a 220 grit. Turn the camera off so I can concentrate and I'll be back when I'm done. All right, it is 8.43. First coat in six hours from now, I can do the second coat and then I can reassemble the pantry. I took the trim off down here. I will be putting it back on. I think it looks great. 